I do have f6 here as well. I also have bishop d1. Um, f6 makes sense. Bishop d1 also makes a lot of... Let's just go here. Keep it simple. go let's play d6 again go here maybe a6 maybe take i'm gonna play the same line again go here he's probably gonna play e5 okay he's not going to okay i'll play e6 oh i'm supposed to go bishop c6 i played the wrong order go here 94 okay i'll go go here maybe bishop c6 next move What did I just do? Um, I guess I can take and take. I guess I take. Takes is not great. Oh, uh, let's just go here. I guess I go F6 or H6 or something. Let's go F6. Probably I have to go like King F7 or H5 for C8 to also move here. Okay, I think that's a not a mistake per se but let's go here now can i get away with knight just i don't think so. so i'm gonna go king f7 i mean this is really bad for me i mean i must be losing somehow maybe i could have gone h5 even but feels really ugly let's go here i guess i have g5 maybe i also have rook c6 maybe as well it goes bishop g3 i think i'm gonna sack a pawn here just go g6 knight f5 go here knight f5 I mean it's still bad for me but it's oddly not might not be losing in fact anymore uh let's just go here go here okay wait this actually looks like I'm completely fine maybe let's go c4 here I'm actually maybe I have some b4 tricks too <clears throat> okay let's see uh, I'm just gonna move my king oh wait he wants a4 so but a4 I just go b4 it's actually really quite weird yeah I go b4 and now his rook is just stuck somehow buddy Pranav has trapped his rook on a5 for no good reason like really just for no good reason he's got his rook stuck really confusing Uh, thank you to Hybrid Toyota. Thank you to Black Panther. Thank you to Joppel. Thank you to Kyle for the 11. Appreciate it. Goes B3. And obviously take. Takes with the pawn. I mean, this looks really. Wait a second. I feel like I should be fine here. Let's go here in E5, maybe, or G5. I also have Rook C3. I mean, this. Now, four. That's actually a good move, I think. I go queen d8, d7. I have queen a5, and I'm fine, probably. I really don't want to let his rook out of the corner. Let's go here. I'm threatening queen b6. That's my whole point here. If he takes, I just take with a g-pawn. I'm completely fine. Yeah, his, he got his rook trapped for, like, literally no reason. I don't know why he did that. Very, very weird. 
Okay, he goes king h2. Wait, now can't I just take and go queen here? He's got rook f1, rook f8. Wait a second. This is where I want to not blunder. No, it doesn't quite work. So if I go queen b6, he takes. I feel like I should have a win somehow. Actually, if I take... Oh, no, he's got queen g3 and rook h5. That's why. Okay, so let's just go... Let's go here, target the pawn. Oh, did I blunder this? Shoot, I might have made a blunder. Rook e5 doesn't do anything. If I go e5, he gets rook e5, though. Shoot, I misplayed this. Or did I? Wait, I can take? Let's just take. Oh, I should not have done that either. Why did I do this? Got too clever here. Now I might not even survive this. Now I blunder rook h5 too. Shoot. Okay, now I have to just salvage this to make a draw. Here and take. Oh, and I've wondered this too. What, what am I doing? I think I can flag him. Yeah, I can flag him. There we go. We got the win. Wow, close game. Let's go again. Good night, F3. Okay, one of 10. Let's keep going. Let's go B3. Let's, let's slow it down. Let's play E3. Found a way to win that game. Dirty? Um, eh, it's his fault that he didn't win earlier when he should have won. <laughs> did he offer? A, did I offer a draw? Oh, yeah, yeah, exactly. Did I offer a draw, right? That's going to be the new meme, right? Did, did I offer a draw or not? Oh, I meant to go Rook D1. Shoot, the stupid... Play so a stupid ma a stupid play zone. Okay, I can play f4 95. I guess this is actually really annoying. I'm not gonna lie. Let's go here 95. Let's go here and trade. I'm a little bit better, but that's one thing I've noticed is this play zone is kind of annoying. Um, it's actually it's actually like it's it is annoying. I've noticed this happen it's happened on a, in a couple games now, unlike in live chess, where it's like the drag gets stuck. It, you try to drag it and it gets stuck um dirty flags are great content of course but that's only one of ten once again as benjamin points out there's a reason i'm way up on time i uh, think a casual keki for the gifted sub um i mean i guess i obviously should take i mean he can take but that feels a little bit suicidal wow he does it buddy thinks he can survive after bishop b2 okay i mean buddy is certifiably insane thinking that he can survive this diagonal i mean Never has there been a king so completely open here like this. I mean, it's just completely open. Yeah, I mean, that. I mean, I can go queen c3. I can go bishop f3. I mean, this is so bad for black. Think about how I want to do this, though. I think I'm just going to go here. I'm going to keep it very simple and stable. Because I can always play queen c3. There's no big rush here. I goes f6. I'm going to go e4. I'll play a3 at some point. But, I mean, I also have f5. I mean, let's think about this. f5, knight e5. Yeah, let's just go for it. Let's be a caveman. Just going to go right in for the kill with queen h6 here. If he can somehow survive, I'll be impressed. I don't think he can. He's got no development either. These three pieces are on their original squares. And his monarch is all the way on the wrong side here. So I take. 
Right, but now I'm I'm not gonna let go. I'm just gonna keep putting. I'm gonna turn up the heat even more and play h4. Now when he takes, I go here. I'm just gonna ignore this rook. I'm just gonna keep steaming ahead with my attack. And if I need to, I'll take the rook. But otherwise, I don't care. I literally don't care. Um, so let's just keep going. Cool blast ahead. Cool blast ahead. Just all in for the kill. Takes. Okay, I mean, okay. Now he's gonna be lucky if he can survive this. I mean, this is just GG's. He probably actually should take with the F pawn, but it's not gonna help him. Yeah, I go here, I go Queen F2, I take, and again, I'm gonna get two pawns rolling up the board as well. That is just a disaster for black. Absolute disaster. There's knight d4, logical move. Oh, uh, I think I'm just gonna go Queen F2. And I just take the pawn. I can obviously go Rook H4 too. Nah, but I mean, this, this must be winning. Everything is guarded. There are no checks. That's all I had to make sure of. No checks. And now, I mean, he can go King G7, but I go Rook F1, and this is just all over. Go here. I go Rook H6. Now the pawns are going to flow up the board as well, so this is basically just over. Let's go check. Go here, attack the bishop. F6 is coming in. Go here f7 or just check is good enough have g8 next move he resigns Let's keep going to a 10 up he keeps playing the same line i don't really like this but you know what oh he's gonna play an open now okay does this let's play a night i guess oh, let's play a night orf drag dwarf everything dwarf plays h4 i'm gonna play h5 i don't know if it's right go here probably b5 next move Oh, he goes there. Interesting. So I go here. I think I can still go B5. I'll probably have to... Oh, I have B4 and four now. So this is completely fine. That was just a huge blunder by me. Ugh. Okay, let's just pretend nothing happened. Ah, <sighs> so poor. I guess I, I do have knight b6 already, I just realized. Not all, it's not all bad news. Actually, wait, it's, maybe it's not all bad news at all. Wait a second. All right, he's got that. Okay, so what? I can play knight a4 here, but I think I should just castle go for rookie 8d5. Quick play. It's probably bad for me, but it's weirdly not conclusively losing. Guess I can play for d5. I think knight a4 is still right to go knight c5. I hit b2. Still very complicated. Whoa, e5? He wants bishop g6. Wait, if I take, take knight c5. No, because takes, I have knight c5, and he can't maintain the pin. e5 was a huge mistake by Pranav. Huge mistake, because if he takes, I have knight c5. He can't keep the queen on the diagonal. Uh, let's just go here hit the queen now now i'm completely fine i should not even be worse probably let's go here bishop e5 next one maybe knight a4 back uh can't take a queen e7 and take h4 go here double double take the juicer oh he does have g no then i okay no it's okay it's good Oh, he's got rook g6. Shoot. Oh, very poor. Oh, very, very poor. Why didn't I just think there for a second? Oh, very poor. Maybe I can still draw. A a Fg, queen e7, maybe? What am I down? I'm down. What something. I'll go here. So bad. I should have just moved the knight. That was so bad. Why didn't I? Why didn't I think about rook g6? Need a vortex for the two months. Oh, it was so bad.
so bad to throw it like that and then to blunder. Uh, let's just lose this. That's pretty frustrating. I outplayed him in the middle game and then I throw it. Oh, this, this also just doesn't work. So I get mated. Yeah, I threw this game so hard. At least I only have to win two to gain points, though. Since I already beat him two in a row. 4-1 Mar... I should be able to beat him by a 4-1 margin, I think. But I don't mind playing him in Blitz. That was so bad. Ah, uh, so annoying. I'll play him in that middle game. He blunders it all away, and then I throw it right back. I can take and go off. I think I'm just going to go off four right away. I beat him in something very similar to this um, yesterday. So I'm going to keep going for this. So frustrating. So here. Oh, he does have 95, which I also completely forgot was a move. <sighs> very frustrating. Okay, let's play B4 here. Now I can go here and take, though. Now he misplayed it, actually. Now, now I should be better. Do I have a set repertoire that's different? Uh, yes. No, well, not a set repertoire, but I generally do uh, mix it up. Wait a second. This looks wrong. E4, knight, g4. Knight, g4. Knight, g6, knight. Knight, e3. Knight, f8. Knight, d1. Rook, f7. Doesn't look right. Why am I thinking so long here? I think I'm gonna just play H3. I have D4 next move, which makes a lot of sense. So Queen G5, logical move, of course. I'm gonna play A4. Maybe Queen E1 or Queen D2 next move. I think I'm gonna go here, maybe Queen F2, hit the pawn. Very deep concept to hit the pawn on uh, on B6 here. Trying to keep this d4. I mean, yeah, he's gonna go for this with f5. I kind of saw this coming. I take f5. This can't be right. I forget you want trade, trade d5 or something. Wow, he doesn't play f5, and now I mean, now I must be winning. Go. Go here, pack pawn. He gave me too much time. He should have played f5 right away. Now it's too late. I think it's too late. Or is it? Wait, what? F1, rook up one, bishop b6. I'm up two pawns here. Wait, so takes, takes. Let's go for it. Whoops. That's not what... Oh, did I just blunder this? Wait. Go here. If he takes, I just take and I'm fine. He takes, takes, takes. I check and I collect the bishop. I don't know if it's a good move, but I think it works. Actually, it's queen g3, but then I can, I can even go d4 and win the game. Or he takes f5 and win the game. He's thinking about queen g3. I also have rook f3. I can totally tell based on his time usage. 
It's gonna be three one. I've beaten eight and a half, one and a half last time. Uh, Sara would be the semifinal. Yeah, this move just cost me a minute of time, right? So I take, so I take. Rook G6, I saw this as a move, but can't I just go Rook F2? Be careful here. Now, I can obviously trade. Trade and just go here. This must be winning for me. E3, just rookie one. D4, C3. Now, I can play rookie one here. I'm just going to go D4 and C3, though. Um, oh, I was going to go H4, okay. Logical concept. Actually, let's just go here and rook F3. Nothing you can do. I'll just go C3. And then rook F3, and this is just losing. Or is it? Maybe not, actually. Let's go here. Bring the king over. Oh, uh, that's got to be a mistake. Now the A pawn is way too fast. Go here. Actually, I should go here and rook C5, I realized. Go here. get the win 3-1 let's keep going oh uh, let's go back to e5 something simple i beat him eight and a half one and a half with e5 so let's play it again go here bishop g7 b5 standard stuff favorite band of all time um i don't have a favorite per se i guess you could i mean go here in d6 of course should play bishop e3 here i go here oh this castle this is all known by the way so it's all pretty standard okay this is however is already slightly wrong I think f5 is correct just to open it up. I have f4, I have queen d7. I should have played queen d7 first. Go here. Hmm, I missed knight f4. Let's go here. I still have g5. I still can take. I assume this is just losing because I have g5 f4 and I think he's just lost this is just losing I'm gonna get knight g6 knight h4 as well so he's gonna have to resign Dubov is winning now wait Dubov is ahead wait are you serious uh no Dubov's not ahead or he is no well just tell me what the score is oh he's not ahead okay Oh, he's down five. Yeah, so it's not gonna be a close match. Yeah. Okay, let's just take, I guess. Question is, do I have knight g6 here or not? Like, I kind of want to puzzle him because he has queen e2 f1. Let me think about this. Takes knight h4 is. Oh. Yeah, okay, I have to take. I didn't really want to do this, but isn't this just mate? I mean, whatever. Take the pawn. I just go here in knight h4. And I, 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 I would like to see your defense, Mr. Buddy. Show me your defense, buddy. Knight h4, and I mean, he's just made it on g2 or f3. He has no defense here. Um, So, yeah, eight and a half, three and a half. Yeah, so it's over. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Dubov still warming up, I promise. Yeah. Yeah, it's just GG's. Let's see what he's going to do here.
Go again. Right, let's keep playing E4. I've gotten good positions every game with this. We're halfway there. Halfway, halfway to the to here the to the homeland. Okay, he's gonna do this one. Okay, let's go for it. Let's go here. This is the Frankenstein Dracula, you guys, in case you're wondering. Whoops. I'm supposed to take the pawn, of course, and go Queen H3. Plays F4. Okay, it seems like Buddy's studied this, which is kind of annoying. Yeah, I think he's studied this whole line. This is very annoying. Oh, I should have gone Bishop D5. Why didn't I play Bishop D5? That was the right move. Go here. C3 was also better, I think. Yeah, I was supposed to go Bishop D5. That was the right move. And Knight F5. I mean, this could get very scary. I guess I go here in Rookie 1, maybe. Go here, develop the Rook. Here. I had G4 too, I guess. I basically need two moves. I need C3 and G4. That's all I need. Is H5. I guess C3 is correct. I don't actually see why black's better here. Here's D5. Go here. He can't take he loses his queen. And once my queen gets free. Okay, he goes there. That's a lot. That's actually quite reasonable. I should probably just take. And go like go here I'm gonna develop my bishop develop my king this should be okay for me I saw it shoot go here and here this is terrible with knight d4 I just take queen c5 king d2 I'm fine he has to trade Oh god, I blundered mate in one. Jeez. Oh my god. I blundered queen a5 and there's mate in one. Somehow I'm still in the game though. Actually, this is quite messy because b6 is hanging too here. Go here. I have knight f3 and queen c3 or something. Okay, it goes that way. Go here. Queen d4, I have rook d1. Oh, did I just blunder this too? Wait a second, wait a second. This is very complicated. Very tricky. Oh, I hung that too. Shoot.
There we go. Dubs. Dubs in the book. Okay, let's keep going. 5-1. Four to go. Let's go back to Sicilians. I was going to do this again. Okay, let's go here. Yeah, that's what happens. I mean, it's, it, that's the thing. Generally, if you use too much time in the opening trying to get a winning position, there comes a point when either it works or it doesn't. Right, so now I go here and... Right. Uh, I think I'm going to play this. And queen c8. I think I'm going to do... Okay, let's just go e6. It goes rook d1. B7, knight d5, take 6, bishop b5 is fine. Yeah. Oh, wait, no, this isn't fine. All right, it goes queen g4. Different move here. Um, actually bad for me. Feels like some kind of weird prep. Go here. And take. Knight c4. Interesting choice. Just castle. I mean, he has what? Knight d6, I guess. I offered draw. It's his fault he didn't take it. Yeah. Uh, question is, can I ignore this? I want to ignore it, but I don't think I can. Is what E5 again? Yeah, I mean, this could be pretty ugly. Yeah, it goes E5. Could go B5. See his idea at least. Let's just go here. What do I do? Go here. Hmm. Let's all go here. At some point, I have to play B4, I think. Let's see what he does. Wow, he takes on G5. That's. Isn't that insane, or is he just going to sack his queen? He might just sack his queen, I guess. But I don't have to let him. Wait a second. go here. Takes with the queen, I have knight of four. Takes with the king, I have knight of four. He goes rook g3, I'm going to go bishop h8 and queen b7 or something. Yeah, I'm going to line up a battery checkmate here for sure. Depending on what he does. Let's go here. I think this is correct. Very scary position for white. Wait a second. I can also go b4 here. Wait a second. I don't want to go B4, though. Let's go here, I guess. Oh, I thought there was, this was a blunder. I guess it's not. Yeah, I just made a mistake. Go here, maybe Rook C4. Here. Oh, I just hung this. Did I hang a mate? Jesus. Of course, I should have gone rook h4 first, too. Oh, 
I'm low on time as well. Oh, I know I went the wrong way. Yeah, I went the wrong way. Terrible. Need to win three more. Awful game. I was, what, 32-19? Not going to be talking. Sorry, you guys. I need to focus when I win these last three. Way too chill, that game. Ten four no I'm gonna, I'm just gonna beat him three in a row and then I'm gonna stop. Just gain points. That's it. Oh, he's strong. Well, it's not that. I just I don't want to mess up and go below and then have to re re reset. That's why I'm gonna be focused here. I'm just gonna get up a lot of time on the clock and then 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 just uh then the e5 is just an absurd move by him. Wait a second, this is just not a good move. I have all the time in the world here. No French is stream funny. Okay, let's go here. Who really does? Yeah, I mean this this just can't be right. The question is can I castle here? That's really the only question. I'm trying to think. No, I mean I should probably just take take the piece, but you know what? I'm gonna do it. I don't know if it's right, but I'm gonna do it. Take the horse, yeah, but then he takes with a bishop and there's some kind of weird counterplay. Wait, no, no, but this I thought I could... Oh my god, sure enough, I did something wrong. I mean, this is absurd. Oh my god, wait, 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 no, wait a second. Don't panic. I have bishop e6 and it's fine. Bishop d6 and it's fine. Wait, now I take and I go here and I win. Yes, now it's clean. Okay, good. I'm, I'm gonna get a rook instead. I get another another piece. Yeah, he's gonna take with a knight. What? That's just a piece. Okay. Don't tell me, did I blunder a rook f4 trick? I might have actually just blundered a huge trick there. Let's go e5. Might have been some funky trick, but I guess I could have taken and gone check and takes. Okay, two to go. I was, what, 37-19, right? Or not 37-19, 30, 31, 32-19 when I started. Okay, I'm going to get back to e5. I, I still need to start working because he's not playing the open. Go here, bishop g7. Okay, please d4. So I go here, I take and I play knight a5. You can see, you can still go c3 actually, which is probably better. Okay, I'll go here. Okay, place c3. I can obviously trade. I think trading is correct. Go here, target the pawn on e4. Okay, now I just need to finish my development. I think step one is to play like d6 and then bishop g7 and knight e7.
I thought I just go here in castles. Ah, uh, he wants queen d2 and bishop h6. Pretty reasonable. Don't love the position, but I think it's I think I must be slightly better. Let's go here and take. So here I'm gonna play knight e5 next move. He's got a bad pawn on b3, so I should be a little bit better. Queen f4, interesting. I guess I'll I have knight a5. I can also just go here, I guess, and take. Okay, so it gives me bishop h8, which I don't think he should have given me. Um, now, now I think I'm somewhat okay. Let's go here. Somewhat okay. I think I might even be better soon. Go here. He's going to go knight g3, and then I'll go like f6. Uh, wait. First of all, I can take. Second of all, I can play f6. Third of all, I can do something. Wait a second. That's, that's got to be a mistake. Wait, f6. Yeah, yeah, I think this is this is wrong. Because I can just take on g5, he takes. He blundered. I'm going to go knight f7 and just win the game. Actually, knight f7 was better. Knight f7 would have prevented this. Knight f7 was a little bit of a better move. Oh, wow. Wait, what? Oh, am I not winning the bishop? I was sure I was winning this bishop here. Oh, this is actually very poor by me. I was pretty sure I was, sure I was winning this bishop. Oh, that's very poor. Or... And I'm thinking too long again. I should just kind of move soon. Go here. I'll take. Oh, is it 92 here? Takes, takes, should be fine. Okay, so he goes for this. I think I'm just gonna go for this. Hopefully, this isn't a blunder. Okay, it makes a... Oh, it's not a blunder. Shoot. Oh my god, I just threw again. Jeez. He's got no time, though. Wait. here what am I doing Oh, jeez.
Awful. Absolutely awful. Awful, awful game. It's still a draw, so I can't complain, but that was awful. I think Propox go for the Prime. I should not have traded the pieces. I traded... I should not have traded the Rooks. I need refractions for two months. This guy can't finish. Yeah. That was so bad. Okay. Three games. Three games. I mean, I can play H3. I don't know if it's good. I'm going to go Queen F2 and Knight G2. That was so bad. Hmm. Let's go here. I'm just going to castle. Or do I play A4? It's an interesting question. I'm going to go A4 and just castle here. I don't even know if A4 was an idea for black or not, but... Oh, I'm legitimately frustrated right now. Yeah, that's a bad move. Because now, now he's going to give me pressure against the pawn. All right, but I can play like queen e1 and d3 too. I can also go rook f1. Because now I want to go f5 as well. Play this bishop f5, which... This too I should have seen. Okay, let's go here. Target the pawn. You're just playing a bad game. Wait. Yeah, I'm just playing a terrible game suddenly. Out of nowhere. There. I think I'm just going to sack an exchange or something. I was traveling as bishop or queen with bishop c8. Yeah, I had some trick. I didn't see what it was. I knew there was something that was winning. But I'm just annoyed now by the last game because I was completely winning that game. Okay, castles. I guess I go, I don't know, like, I'm just pretty mad at myself right now. When I get mad at myself, I start to make mistakes too, which is probably why I'm, I'm just losing this game. Yeah, I mean, what was, what was, what was this even? Throw this opening out the window. Throwing my rating away. So terrible. Abysmal. Let's go here. Needs Ocean Man? Not really. I just need to, like, not win. I need to win games where I'm winning. Not just blitz. Played B through on move one, which is a huge blunder. Go here. While this is losing, there is some kind of weird counterplay here. There is some kind of weird counterplay. Coming up in seven hours, yeah. It okay, goes first, so I go here. Okay, but I mean, this is quite scary because I have C3. Okay, rookie six. And I should have some tricks here. Let's go here, maybe. I mean, I feel like this is getting very scary for black. Oh, did I just throw the game or something too?
I just threw the game. And I just blundered again. Oh, I'm just blundering every which way now. Oh, I hung that too. Yeah, I'm just playing bad chess. Okay, let's let me let me just ignore chat. I'm gonna I'm gonna beat him. I'm gonna I'm gonna beat him five in a row. No, actually, you know what? No, no joking. I'm not. I'm just gonna fool on folks and crush them. So sorry, chat, but this is where I ignore you guys. Because now I'm actually just mad again, like I was last night. Of course, I did this, which I shouldn't have done. This is where I get mad, and now now I just blow him off the board. Like, no nonsense. Because now I'm pretty angry. I just want to see if his quality dips when I don't talk. And I just am completely silent, just playing chess. Okay, let's go back here. So if you learn in the chat, funny, think of Claire Cottontail for the 36 months. At Bishop A5 too, he missed Bishop A5. Let's see, I have E4, I have Bishop G4, a lot of options. Okay, finds the E4, but that shouldn't really change much. Now I have Queen G3, and he just resigns. Queen H3, Queen E3. There we go. Okay, nobody cares. That's one up. Nine to go.
I'm going to play d4 here. Knight d2 and c4. Hmm, interesting. He doesn't take. Okay, now I'm up a pawn. I should be much better. Play bishop b2 back, I guess. Great, so the bishops. Okay, I mean, this is... Great, let's go here. Actually, knight c3 is probably quite good too. But I'm just going to go here and c3 or something. Maybe c4. Looks quite a bit better for me. It's a little bit of technique. Okay, now there's a b7 pawn that he hangs. Of course, I should take. Uh, Le Lev is uh, Lev is up to thirty one forty three. Nice, nice rating. Let's think. Rookie one ninety two. King f one. Okay, I can go to G two, but I think. I should go to h2 place h5 okay now now i know that i'm just winning i just have to find a couple of good moves um bishop c6 seems like one option knight b5 seems like another option and what is this threat exactly if i go f4 oh, there's no threat this is just winning let's go f5 next move Okay, I'm up a pawn here. I have to maneuver this. Go here. Bring the knight into the game. Knight a5, maybe knight c6, just bring the king closer. This allows a check. Allows me to go here too. Fork, of course. Yeah, okay, now now I win the game. Go here. Okay, there we go again. Two up. Go here. <clears throat> yeah, eight more to go. Yeah, I mean, I'm not. I'm not even gonna talk. I'm fully focused on this game.
Erroneous up by eight. Oh, wow. Okay. Yeah, that doesn't seem right. Wait, or did I just blunder? I thought he couldn't do this for some reason. I don't think he can do this. My instinct is that he can't do this. If this doesn't work, it doesn't work, but so be it. Take. I, I, I don't believe this. I think he's just making up stuff here. Go here. No, he's making this up. Now, now he's just losing. This just doesn't work. Oh, wait, wait. I got to be careful. I was about to blunder a checkmate with rookie eight. Wait a second. I got to be a little bit more careful than that. Go here. Go here. Check. Move the king, and now I mean now I just go rookie eight, and it's just over. Okay, that's much better, much better. Let's just go. I don't know. Bishop d4 is probably just completely fine too. I have rookie eight here. I mean, there's gonna be some tricks, of course, down the road with some knight f4. I'm going to go knight f6 here. But actually, let's just go rook g8. I'm trying to keep this as simple as possible. That doesn't do anything. Take and take with the knight. Now, as queen's under attack, I mean, g4 is under attack. I have knight f6 later. Queen h3 runs into h5. Okay, he's trying. He's still trying desperately to keep the game alive. And now I just have to find the winning move. This is one of them. Now I threaten the mate. He can't go knight e3. If he goes rook g1, I just take the rook, and that's game over. He resigns. Three up, seven to go. Let's go back to e4 here. Thank you to it's Rubix for the prime. Thank you so much. Um, Pranav should be a GM. Yeah, I would just say he, he should be a GM. He's going to play the same line. Um, again, one thing that's tricky is, of course, someone said civilians in chat. So I do need to keep that in mind so that I start dodging with random, random, random garbage openings and not playing mainline theory. He's going to play this one, okay? B3 is still correct. Okay, H4 is obviously a move here. I'm gonna play it. It's not it's not necessarily the right move. So G3, Bishop H3, Bishop D3. Classic position, not clear cut. Okay, it goes there, which I think is slightly wrong. So I'm gonna have H5 or something. Go here, King G2, of course. <laughs> Sevilla, are you here, buddy? Yeah. Yeah, someone said Sevilla is in the chat, and I assume he is in the chat. I mean, he should be in the chat, obviously. Okay, let's just take. Mm -hmm. Oh, I had something better than this. I missed something. Okay, let's think for a second. Go here. <laughs> I'm afraid of Svidler. No, I'm not afraid of him, but I do have to keep that keep that in mind. Um, there's a good chance he's watching, so like I don't want to like show some absolute mainline thing. No, but Svidler should. I mean, that's, that he should. Like, I'm, I'm actually not trolling. Like, he should do that. 100% he should do that. Like, no cap. Go here. I mean, I obviously have takes and something at some point. Okay. Now, he does this. I mean, he's really begging me to break. He's really, really begging me. You know what? I just somehow I don't actually believe it. 
Wait, I have to be careful where I put the queen here. Go here. Hopefully, I didn't just blunder. Okay, let's just take. I got to do this. Sooner or later, I have to do this. Don't know why it took me so long to finally do this. Go here, I guess. Not thrilled with my position here, I have to say. Rook G5, though. There's some unpleasantness here for black, I have to say. Oh, did I just blunder? Oh, no. I think I just made a blunder. Rod. Oh, why did I do that? Why did I do that? Blundered so badly. Well, maybe I have this in D6. Wait, maybe it's not so clear. I don't see a mate. Wait, okay, let's think. Oh my god, did I really do this? Oh my god, I threw that so hard. So bad. Can't believe I did that. Oh my god, on E1 I could have taken his queen on E4. Oh my god, was this queen hanging on E4? My queen on C1 was protected. That's so bad. My queen on E1 was so protected. Thank you, Alan, for the time. My queen on E1 was completely protected. Oh, that was terror. My queen on C1 was protected, wasn't it? Wait a second. Wait, I think my king was protected. Oh my god, my king was protected. My queen was protected on C... Oh my god, okay. That's so bad. Wait, um... Go here in bishop b4. Terrible. That's so bad. Let's go here in d5. Yeah, now, now I'm going to tilt this game away just like that because I'm just mad about the previous one. I'm going to go here in King D7 or something silly.
Yeah, I'm just now I'm just tilting this game away because I'm mad. What am I even doing? I was so bad. I mean, I was just so bad. The queen was just guarded on E1 there. That's just ridiculous. I thought the queen was hanging on C1. That's why I didn't do that. In case you guys were wondering, you're like, so like why did I just take the queen? It's because I forgot it was guarded. Basically, that's the only reason. Yeah, okay, I'm just down two pawns. You're probably just lost. Ugh. But I can still try to blitz him. The queen was so guard. The queen was completely guarded. Why did I do that? Like, I don't even know why I did that. The queen on C1 was completely guarded. Oh, so bad. Maybe it isn't so bad. It's kind of weird. Like, it's bad, but it's not, like, easily winning for white. I'll give him this. I'm going to have to bring my knight back. stupid and now I blundered this too Of course I allow this too and I lose. Oh Jesus. Tilting. Tilting all over the place. Uh just tilting. I let that previous game affect me. Now I actually really have to just refocus in one seven. This is why I hate playing long blitz sessions. Because eventually you end up in these long spots where it's like you just have to win so many games, you lose the game early, and then you just have to keep going. Uh, no, I don't want... No, I'll be back over 32. I just have to play good chess, and I'm not doing that. That's the problem. I'm playing somewhat decent at times, but I let that previous game just tilt me completely, and then I just blunder in the opening. Here. Chad is trying so hard to tell me. I mean, I'm a little bit tilted. I'm, I'm just well, not tilted really, but I'm just like frustrated at my play because like I, I just I really wanted to play better before for the match tomorrow, and like I'm just not playing well at the moment. 
actually it's not even maybe it's maybe not even right now it's just the fact that i played i played so poorly yesterday at the end of the stream and now i'm doing the same thing here right now where i'm playing so poorly again that i think is more what it is it's just like the fact that it's two days down in a row where it's like i'm playing these guys and i mean I, I i either just shouldn't play so many games or i should just stop at some point like already again i'm thinking forever here in a position where i shouldn't be thinking and the other problem is now it's becoming a little bit too serious as well like I, i'm just really really like it's just becoming crazy serious Take. Go here. I'm gonna play H3. B3, maybe A4. Just ignore chat. Yeah, chat's being ridiculous, but it doesn't matter. I mean, it's typical chat. Like, if, if, I, if, I, if I get a little bit tilted, they just love to, like, pile on I'm gonna go b3 which probably is not a great move this and e5 I mean I, I am better here question of how much better really a3 well you just played bishop e6 which is just a terrible move complete lack of understanding by playing bishop e6 he should have put the bishop on b7 and on the other diagonal let's see now how am i be i know i'm better here 100 percent i'm better it's a matter of playing good moves let's go e5 and bishop e4 this is a good this is like the start of actually maybe trying to play decent chess go here now i've worked d1 pressure on the knight okay that does nothing that's just a free pawn thank you very much let's find bishop c4 very annoying Oh, I have a trick with bishop b6 here. I didn't even see it, but it works out. Yeah. No, I really want to adopt him. I really just want to, like, slow it down completely. Really, really focus and just, just adopt him. Or... or I can just hang a pawn or I can just hang a pawn and with it like kind of ruin this whole game oh my god as soon as I get an advantage I immediately throw it away literally as soon as I get an advantage I throw it away hang the pawn on e5 and throw the whole thing I am still better though I think what is this queen d1 yeah and he resigns okay so here rook d2 and take the file and just end the game i have adopted i have adopted this guy before it's not like i haven't played him i have adopted him just to be clear No tricks with rook g2 here. Rook h4 is probably better. H4 is easier. Of course, he should resign here some point soon. Go here. Let's do this. He loses time. Go here. one I don't know what a3 is exactly
question is can i play f6 here this is a big question i don't know if i can i don't really trust it so i'm not gonna go for it but h6 probably h5 i don't want the bishop on g5 it's very annoying so i'm just gonna rotate my knight around go a5 here try to open up this side because i don't really know which side he's castling on here go back doesn't really concern me let's go here I mean, is he really castling kingside is kind of the question. I'm much better here. Much better. Let's see if I can actually not throw this game. Yeah, <laughs> thank you. You know, Omega Chad for the prime of this castle. By the way, takes was a mistake. He should have taken with the bishop. And then he had a knight b6 fork. Like, that was very, very bad by me. Very, very bad. Okay. Oh, so bad. Okay, because he's going to go f5, and then I take and take with the e-pawn. Or not. Okay, he's going to try to do something else. Go here, I guess. I don't even know why I did this, though. I mean, I took on b5. It was just ridiculous. There's no point, no reason to taking on b5. It made absolutely no sense. Okay, it goes queen d2. But now I get knight f5. Now there's some tricks, I think. I check and take no I have to take maybe I was supposed to take with the jeep on there again I feel like I'm misplaying this I am misplaying this I, I'm actually not doing great now go here Go here and try to hit the pawn. Oh, bishop h6 was such an obvious move. Why didn't I go bishop h6? <sighs> bishop h6 was such an obvious move there for me. Take a breath, relax. Yeah, I mean, it's probably just... It's, it's an accumulation of too many long streams, I think. Too many long streams, and it's all kind of adding up now. Uh, at least that's my read of it. I, I oh I I had knight c7 here and I was fine. Missed that too. Lovely. Lovely. Yeah. I I am. Wait. I am missing everything. Go here, I guess. Don't I have this or am I blind? I mean, this might just be terrible, but I think I trapped his rook. I won one, right? See me angry like this? It's just too many long streams. That's what it is. Too many long streams over long, this long period of time. And it's just like it's catching up with me. I just have to make sure that tomorrow when it matters, I don't I don't actually mess up. That's the, that's the real danger here. Okay, I'll take... Go here, I guess. That's actually the real danger. Is that like, uh, is that I let this, I let this carry over to, um, into like into tomorrow, and that's when, that's when you know, that's when it's, it becomes really a problem. Go here. I check. I think finally he made a blunder. No, he's got this. Shoot, he keeps finding these stupid resources. Really annoying. Actually, okay, let's go here. Okay, but now I can trade rooks. Okay, 
Okay, I got to do this and open it up. Okay, I'm just going to flag him. There we go. Okay, two. Let's keep going. I'm going to play the same. It's just not normally what I play, but I'm going to play it. I'm gonna play this one, which is not generally considered great. This is definitely not right. So here in H4, this is pretty terrible for black. Wait, what? Wait, what on earth is this? Wait a second. I mean, he's just getting crushed on the king side here. Uh, do Bob's make it more respectable down by five? Yeah, but it's it's over, isn't it? I mean, this has to be losing. Okay, let's let's just take a deep breath. Um. I mean, I have Queen H two even here, which is just GGs. I mean, you can try something like Queen G six, but I just take. I mean, this this has to be lost. Okay, let's think. Queen H2 is one move that surely wins. What is this move after Queen H2? H8 only move, and then I can just trade everything, I guess. I see there's a quicker win than Queen H2. I don't see it, so I think this, this looks like a pretty safe win. I mean, he has to go Rook H8, and I can just take and go Bishop F6, or I can even just take the Knight at the end. I mean, it's, it is a piece. Yeah, it is a piece. It's game over. Um, three. There we go. Yeah, Bishop F6 first is also a move, but I think just being up the knight is more important. Okay, that doesn't do anything. I just... I mean, okay, wait a second. Wait a second. I just take... I mean, takes I've made. I just go Queen H8. There we go. Three up. Okay. Keep going. I got a good position. I'm going to stick with it. He's going to play this. I guess I'll play C6, D5 again. So we'll play the same line, I guess. Okay. Interesting. Okay, let's just go here, I guess. Hmm. Okay, let's play f6 here. I think this is a little bit premature by my opponent. Feels very premature, at least. Just... What? Is that just a mouse slip, or is he, like, losing his mind? I don't know what this is. Uh, thank you to Kazzy Bass for the tier ones. Thank you so much. Um, can I pronounce premature again? Yeah, it was very premature. Um, what? What is premature not a word or something? I don't understand. Okay, now I think I'm just gonna go h6. I mean, all I need is e5, e4, and then I just win the game, basically. He has some knight g5 nonsense that I don't really like. He 
you know what it, it is it, what, what's the big deal i mean it's just a big center why, why am i panicking here i just go knight f6 oh or he can do this but and yeah, now i just go here castles and i just win the game go here i'm just knight f5 e4 i mean this is all very straightforward you need a touch pad for the seven months thanks so much okay I mean, e4 is just strong. I mean, that's just very, very good for me. He's got a grip on the dark square. It's the only thing he has going for himself right now. But, I mean, again. Okay, go c3. All I need to do here is bring my pieces to the king side. That's the only thing that I need to do. Take with a pawn. He's going to go queen d4 here, probably. Go f4. c4, I go d4, of course. I mean, this is just so bad for white. Let's just go here. I mean, I have 95, king h8. I mean, everything is collapsing. I mean, he gets knight c5, but I'm just going to go here. Okay, he just resigns. Four. Let's keep going. Okay, let's go back to d4. He did not show me anything that game. He showed the previous game. He showed me nothing. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna, make, I'm gonna make him show me something. Um, as they, as they say in St. Louis, it's like the show me state uh, right now. I'm basically asking him to show me his real opening. Cause if this is his real opening against the, um, against the, uh, against the same -ish, it's very bad. Okay. So he still wants this. I mean, he still wants this a five nonsense, but it just isn't very good. I go H four and H five. I mean, this is just not good for, not good for black. There's always going to be some knight of five. I had a lot of games when I was younger in the King's Indian in this where like my opponents would get h5, g5, and I would just suffer forever. And it was so unpleasant to face. Yeah, this, this is just losing. This is actually positionally almost lost for, for um, black. I go rook b1, I have b4. Actually, but you know what? There's no rush here. I can even go rook b1. I won a game against this IM from the Philippines. I think his name was, I think, Louis Chiang. And um, I, he played this against me. I just, I, I somehow survived his black and won, but I was just suffering so badly. Uh, Dubov almost winning. What do you mean? He's three points down with 10 minutes left. Wait, what? Um, yeah, h5, g5, just so unpleasant. I mean, even c5 here. I mean, so c5. It's Dubov's about to be up. It's very reminiscent of Dubov's match against Nepo Man. Uh, Dubov had this match against, or not Dubov, sorry, Levon had this match against Nepo Man. Where in bullet, it was like, it got really close, too. Okay, let's think. I'm totally winning here. Go queen c4, I can take and take. Knight f5 is coming in, knight b5 is coming in. Everything here is, is very, it's happy at the time. Um, I don't want to really give him counterplay here, so how do I stop counterplay? Knight f5 is one way to stop counterplay, but even, I mean, even just rook a1 and queen c5 is just no counterplay either. Something happened to Pranav? Um, not really. I'm just, I'm putting the hurt on him this, this game. I'm just going to go here. I'm not even concerned. I just don't want to give him anything. I'm not going to give him an inch. Uh, okay, now he does it, but I can actually take and go d6 maybe. I have d6 here. Let's see. d6. No, d6 is just gg unless I'm insane. Yeah, this is gg. He loses the pawn and he loses the knight. Knight. Yeah. Yeah, it's just gg. Oh, no. Wait, I miss. Oh, God. I missed this. I'm still winning, thankfully. Oh, uh, but that was. Oh, man. I just. That was a huge blunder by me. Wait. Okay. I need to reset. Oh man, that was terrible. That was a huge blunder. Jeez. Thank you. I will. I will. <laughs> yeah. Okay, this is over. I go here. Okay, resigns. That's what? Five? Let's keep going. Levon is losing every game of bullet. Okay. I mean, I might have to pop over there. Go here. That was five, right? 
That was not six. Go here. Uh, thank you, Chase ZT, for the prime. Thank you so much. Uh, Pranav just blundered again, but it's not clear if I'm winning. Go here. Oh, did I just make a blunder? Wait a second. Oh, did I just make a blunder? I think I just made a blunder. Did I make a blunder or not? Which one? Seven, I think. No, I didn't make a blunder. If I have this move and I can just take. I didn't make a blunder. I'm still good. Still good. Um, yeah, you guys can tell me if the Dubob match gets really tight, I will go back and follow. Um, so really, so Levon is actually throwing? Jeez. Okay, now I need to be careful. It's actually not trivial. Somehow I'm not, I'm not even winning anymore. This is ridiculous. That's why I hate, this is why I hate the hippo actually, because the hippo, you think you're winning and then you find, then you realize you're not actually winning. Yeah, it's like you think you're winning and then you're not actually winning. I go here. I have knight g6 maybe. Yeah, I, I hate the hippo because there are a lot of these positions where it's like the hippo just like... You think you're just winning and you should be winning and then it's like very, very unclear somehow out of the blue. Like I'm not even winning anymore probably. Even though he, he blundered a piece and he gets rewarded. Unbelievable. I mean, it's still okay, probably, but it's frustrating. Shacks, okay. I mean... Wait, did I just hang mate? No, I... Um... I didn't I didn't actually see Queen F7. That's so bad. Yeah, I didn't even see this and, and I'm just losing or something. I didn't I did not even see Queen F7 check. Yeah, this is unbelievable. I didn't see Queen F7 check and now, now I'm just losing. I didn't see Queen F7 at all. Oh my god. Ugh. I mean he blunt he made a clean blunder and I just I have nothing against it. I mean, he just made a clean, clean blunder. And he gets rewarded for it. So gross. if I go here oh he's got some knight of five nonsense too of course he always has some trick unbelievable literally unbelievable guy just hangs a knight and he has a miracle tactic to save it So lucky. Dubov's gonna win. Wow. There's G4. I mean, yeah, I mean, obviously I'm just lost. I'm just gonna make moves. Should have played Rook C8 first.
Yeah, if I go work C8 first, I have some some hope. Uh, but this is just nothing. Oh, he blundered mate. Oh my god. Oh my god, he blundered mate. Six. Let's go. Let's go. He blundered mate. Oh my god, that was ridiculous. He blundered mate. Okay, let's go. Now we're back on track. Let's keep going. That was the one game that I played badly. And I got the win somehow. Okay, I can play E4. Let's play traditional A3. All right, I want to play this one. Okay, I'm going to play this weird line with knight h3. I have this against Arkady Knightich, and um, mean e4 is still correct. Gary Kasparov also played this take. It's not correct, by the way. Pranav is not playing this very well. Let's go e4. Don't give up. Yeah, don't, don't, uh, don't give up. Bridge is G5. Wait, okay. I know I'm much better. Let's think. Knight G5 doesn't work. Just take. Okay, let's take. Oh, did Dubov just get disconnected and lose the match? Wait, what happened to Dubov? Wait, wait, what would you what happened to Dubov, you guys? Uh did Dubov Dubov got disconnected? Oh my god. So he's like he's he's torching Levon is what you guys said, right? Oh man, okay, let's just go here. By the way, while we're at it, seven. Okay, resign, let's go again. Um, let's keep going G6. I've gotten good positions. Okay. Okay, he's gonna do this. I'm gonna go back to C6, D5. I mean, I, I don't believe him. This is 8, right? This will be 8. Alright, uh, he's gonna play Bishop G5 here. I guess I'll go here and C5, maybe. Aha, uh -huh, he has a quick attack. Okay, whatever, let's go. Maybe he can survive this, but maybe not. A4, he threw an A4, A6, which was a big mistake. I mean, the K can go here. Has to be right. I don't know if it's right. Maybe Knight C6 is better. Knight B4 and D4, maybe. I feel like I should have some tactic here that I'm not seeing. Let's go here. I want a castle too. I mean, he has H, no, H5. Maybe I can even sack something. Okay. Um. So what happens? So Levon is going to win the match because of bullet. Is that what you guys are saying? I think that's what you guys are saying, right? Unbelievable. Okay, let's think for a second. I'm trying to figure this out. I'm trying to work this out. I, I call, I call, I call, I call your bluff and I raise you. Wait, let me make sure there's no tricks with H6. H6, D takes E3. No, I call, I call your bluff and raise you. Okay, so I take and I, I think it's just that. Um, okay. I think it's going to be number eight, by the way, just to be clear. So Levon's going to win. I assume he wins because of disconnection. I mean, this is still messy. This is not clear cut, by the way, this game. But I think I'm winning. You cannot call and raise. Oh, that's right. Yeah, it, it, yeah. you can't call and raise. Sure. You either have to, like, call or you have to raise. Right. I, uh, yeah, I said I call and I raise. That's actually because in, in the movie, there's a movie called... um, There's a movie, uh, The Sting, I think is what it's called. And of H6, I just take. And I take the rook and I take and I win. But there's a movie called The Sting. And in The Sting, um, I think that's what one of the characters says. He, he calls the bet and then he says... I think that he calls the bet and then he says, I call and I raise or, or something. 
um so that, that's where i'm getting it from of course you obviously you can't do that okay now i'm much better here i should just be winning not mess this up um okay what's the clean way to win this is the question f5 makes sense knight c6 does not make sense just take i mean this has to be just winning go here maybe knight d5 was better i don't know bishop f3 okay i mean uh that's should not have done this go go here Should be winning. Oh, he has to take and I just go rook a7 and he resigns, actually. This is very easy. Hey, you guys. Eight. Let's keep going. Keep going, d4. A turn takes. Plays E5. Okay, this is another way to play this line. I think I'm supposed to just take and go Queen C2. Actually, I was supposed to go queen c2 first, but okay, let's think. Queen c2, knight f3 doesn't work. So I just go here and bishop f2. I'm going to castle. If he takes, I just take, and I think I'm fine. I think my two bishops are very good. He also opens up his file as well. I don't even know if castles is right, but this looks completely fine. I'll pre-move because it's a safe pre-move. Uh, thank you to Tack Wee for the prime. Thank you to Doll for the 300 bits. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. So, okay. So, who, um, so who's, uh, so who, who's in or who's out, by the way, you guys? Because it doesn't seem really clear to me. Okay, now, I thought I could go knight f4 here and take. So, love is through, right? Okay, so I see his ID. He wants knight c5. I can also play f5 or g4. I'm gonna go g4 here. Okay, how do I do this exactly? I mean, I know I'm a little bit better. I don't know how much better. I'm gonna play f5 here. Probably I want to go king b1. Um. Let's move the king. Ah, is there a 94 trick? Wait, I hope there's no 94. Okay, go here, of course. I don't like bishop c6. I think that's a mistake. He's trying to get he's trying to cheese me with bishop a4. I don't think it's in the spirit of the position. And now I have h4 g5 to go out full on launch. Okay, let's just go. Okay, I don't want to go queen d2. Somehow I need to activate. Is h4 right? Okay, let's just go h4 and attack. Because now he can't really move his rook. His rook is very awkward here. I mean, maybe, maybe I just have rook hg1 and g5. Just very, very smooth, simple chess here. Yeah, right now I'm, I'm just like kind of... I'm in the zone. I'm in the zone. It goes knight d3. Or knight, knight b3, I should say. Queen f4 is a move. Queen f4, queen e5. An idea. Mm, knight p3 is a good move, actually. Here. Go here. I mean, I still have g5 here. That's my big gamble. He still has knight c5. D5 is very reasonable. I mean, I still have G5, but I assume I take. I should be five. I just take the knight. Wait, wait, wait a second. Wait a second. This doesn't look right at all. Go here. Go 
here. Target the queen. I do have f6 here as well. I also have bishop d1. Um, f6 makes sense. Bishop d1 also makes a lot of... Let's just go here. Keep it simple. <gasps> oh my god. I just threw it. Oh my god. I just threw it. Oh Jesus. Oh my god. I just threw it. That was that was number that was that was ten. I win that game. I I win that game. That's ten. Okay, last three. Oh my god. I I don't go bishop d one. That's I just win that game. I play f sixteen into any other move. I win that game. Uh, I mean, it's jeez. Yeah, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna get back to thirty two twenty and then I'm stopping. Oh my god, how did I not see queen c1? I played so well to get to that point too. That's so upsetting. That's so upsetting. Um. It's so upsetting. I also had bishop h6 there. I should have played, but whatever. Oh my god, I can't believe I did that. The plays were Oh now I just hang up hung, hung upon an E5. Yeah, now I'm just now I'm just throwing. Oh my god, what the fuck? Go here on Queen E7. Yeah, I'm just throwing so hard here. I mean just ridiculous. unbelievable work so hard to get to that point and then i have to just throw it out play i completely outplay him every game to get to that point and then i play bishop d1 and now i immediately throw this game unbelievable new gem benjamin bach for the good something to beast for the tier one thank you So upsetting. Now my king is garbage here too. Oh yeah, my king is just so terrible. I don't even know if h5 does anything, but I'll play it. Just need to move and pray. <sighs> Ridiculous. ABTGR for the four months. Thank you. Uh, I'm just pissed off now. And here, I guess. So unreal to throw the game like that. So unreal. Almost surreal. I guess that's the word I would use. Let's go here. Oh, no, I like check or something. Or King G8. Yeah, it's like surreal. Unreal is the wrong word. It's just surreal. Can't believe I did that. Let's work out for one interesting choice. <sighs> Unbelievable. Yeah, that's just completely lost. I, I literally have no good moves here. Go, I don't know. I mean, it's not going to matter if I win tomorrow, I guess. I guess that's the, the upside, but still very frustrating. What is H3? Interesting choice. Okay, let's go here, I guess. Interesting choice. I might I might have a chance to get back in this game now. 
I mean, that was a fairly serious mistake. Um. Oh, that's a good move too. It's got no time though, I just realized again. Oh, I queen c1. Oh my god. Okay, we got the win. Oh my gosh. I think Polly was her thing to play help. Okay, let's go back to D4. Okay, I mean, that makes up for the previous game because I was so completely toasted that game. That makes up for the previous one, I guess. That makes up for the previous one, right? e5 again so i'm gonna take right but now i think i can play here because now i have bishop f4 he didn't play h6 so it's a little bit different let's just do the same line i want to see it i right, plays this which is not right wait i need to make sure though e4 h6 or h6 uh, let's just trade and castle, I guess. I mean, I can castle here, I guess. I don't really like it, but I'm going to do it anyway. Oh, of course, I blunder immediately again. Actually, is this a blunder? Wait. Maybe it's not a blunder. Wait, let's go. Go here. Maybe it's not a blunder. I have 93. And I have f4. And actually, maybe it's not a blunder. Okay, I go here in rook g3. This actually is really scary for black now. Here. I mean, f4, f5 is a move that I have. I also have 91. I don't want to go b3. I don't want to go knight b4. I kind of want to play f4 and f5. Five, but I don't think it works. I, I have to go B3, which I hate. Mm -hmm. Okay, that looks like a strange move. Okay, I don't care. I've got to go all in for the attack. He can take a pawn. I don't care. Take a second pawn in H2. I mean, I, I'm not worried. Go here. All I need is f4, f5. That's all I need. I just need f4. If I can get f4 in, I'm going to be much better. I can go knight b4, knight... Actually, this looks quite scary, maybe. I just want to be careful here. Knight b4, bc4. Yeah, let's go for it. I'm going to play knight d5. is very scary. I can take the pawn. I mean, this looks very scary for black. Because he's not getting any attack on the queen side here. Yeah, I think that this might be really, really good for me. Thank you to Thunder for the $3. Thank you so much to Thunder. Appreciate it. This is pretty scary for Black. Okay, let's go here. This Queen D. I mean, sacking looks scary. I can take. I mean, okay, let's just go for it. I'm going to go for the kill with F4. He's going to lose this game, I think. I mean, my attack is so fast here with F5. Yeah, my attack should be too fast. I mean, he's going to lose this, and he's, his whole house is going to burn down. His king has no protection. This looks terrible. Looks terrible. Okay, let's take. 
I mean, how is he? Sur I mean, he has to take. I mean, he's not survived. Okay. First of all, I have check. Let's slow it down. I have a buck 24, which is all the time in the world. So all I need to do is come up with the line that wins. Rook G6 looks winning, but you know what? I, I think I'm just going to check and then take. There's no rush. No, uh, I have Rook F1. And just checkmate. Okay, there we go. Two to go. Um, let's go back to G6 here. Go here. I'm gonna do the C6 D5 again. He's he has not impressed me in any of these lines. I mean, he really has just has not impressed me. Let's go here. Go E6 here. Uh huh. I please wait. Do I take? Wait, I have Queen B6 here. Is this a free pawn or am I just insane? Okay, do you want, wait, 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 wait. I must be much better here. I just have to finish the piece play. Okay, let's go here. Trade some bishops. Step one. I think he has to go queen e2. I'm going to trade and then go queen e7, knight e7, castle. Then I just win the game. So let's just take, of course. Uh, wait, that's just a... Isn't that a blunder or not? Queen G... Wait, that's just a blunder. I go here. Okay, here we go. Another one. Thank you to Clyde to Times for the 18. Thanks so much, Clyde to Times. Appreciate it. I just go here. Like the juicer and the game. Okay. Much better. Much, much better. Do I take with the knight or the rook? I mean, I assume I take with the rook. This has rook h1. I mean... Take. I mean, he's getting some weird rook h8 nonsense. Bizarre. Always has some nonsense. Let's play rook h4, though. Now I take. Okay. I just go knight to 7 Very good. Very, very good. Okay, let's keep going. Let's keep going D4. He is not he's not proving anything in D4. Every game I'm I'm beating him out of the opening. Um oh he wants to play this one, okay. Oh, he wants to play okay, very interesting. Thing is, I'm playing for F4 2 in this system. That's the problem with this. I'll play A4. I don't know if I need to, but it's thematically the best move. Problem is I'm playing for F4 here. That's actually the big problem for black. New Thierry Aragaro for the 11 months. Thanks so much. Okay, plays knight h5. Um, he wants f5. I can play f4 myself. F4 myself makes sense. I mean, huh? What are the what's the move that I want to play? I don't want to spend too much time here because f5 is a serious move. Uh, I don't want to go f4. I think I'm just gonna go here and take maybe. I'm going to take and play f4. Oh, okay. He wants to do this one. Rook b8. Interesting. Okay, let's go here. I don't even know knight g1 is necessary, but it stops f5. I still have f4 in my back pocket. Just there. I mean, I guess h3 is reasonable. There's no reason I can't play it. Go here. Go here. Here. I think rook a3 makes sense. Laterally, do something on his third rank. Let's go here. Bishop b2 next move. He's starting to misplay this. This is starting to get very iffy for, for black. I can go bishop f3 even. I'm just going to stop him from playing f5, basically. He can, he can never really play it, but if he has to take with a bishop, this can never really be all that special. Go here. This is starting to get very bad for black. I'm going to go here and maybe b4, maybe bishop a5. He still wants f5. Don't want to f actually I should not have allowed this. It's kind of a little bit questionable. Hmm. F5 takes takes. F4. You know what? Let's just go B4. I can always take and play F4 later. Okay, he goes F5 as expect. Let's take. Go here. I'm gonna play rook b3, keep an eye on these pawns. With F4, I always have Bishop G4. If E4, I think I have to go F4. I go F4.
If he takes, I take, and I get an icy six. So I'm doing pretty well, I think. Another 10-hour stream? I don't know. I feel like time is really going by fast now. Um, I don't like night eight. I go here. I mean, it feels like this is starting to go the wrong way. Or black. Let's just go queen c2, I guess. And I always have takes. It's very unpleasant. Very, very unpleasant. Yeah, I don't know what time. I, how long have I even been live? I've kind of lost track. Ever since I got really deep into this match, I've totally lost track of where I'm at. Um. Goes there. Wait, but now take. Wait, this has to be really bad. Let's go here. I don't know what. Why did I play rook one? This does nothing. I'm gonna bring the bishop back. I guess guard the pawn. And now I can go here, target the knight. Go so here. I have knight h, knight a4, h4. Of course, if he goes knight g4, I take. I have to take that way. Now I'm starting to really work him on the queen side. Okay, that doesn't do anything. I can just play knight e2 even. Yeah, this this has to be losing. It's just a matter of how I crash through. I, I want to just be smart though, and not throw this game so let's go here on bishop b2 i'm basically crashing through on the queen side here so he can't really do a whole lot these are chess players not enjoyers indeed okay let's go here it takes okay i can get the gun do we want the gun no i, I want the all other gun i want the rooks in front i want to i want to smash through on this file go here i don't know why i did this move it does nothing Thing is, he's kind of stuck. I'm going to put my knight on e3. This is terrible for black. Oh, he's trying. Now he's trying to do something. Like king h7 and knight g6. Um, I'll just go here, I guess. I mean, okay, let's just go for it. I mean, this this has to be winning. I don't have. I don't quite have the gun. Of course, I gave him bishop a4, obviously. Wait, but I can still take and go knight d5 at the end. Now we go here. I've got an 85 coming in. And he's too slow. All right, we got the dub 20 to 6. All right, guys, I'm going to take a short break, go run to the restroom, and then we'll keep going right on. So uh, give me one second.